Okay, in this video, we'll make a very simple 3D object in Blender, and we'll import it into Smile Game Builder. So, open your Blender, and we'll start a new general project. In that general project, you'll have three objects. You can delete those. Then you can go to the Add, then go to Image, and then Images as Planes. For this video, I created a very simple cartoon tree. So let's import that. Now, if we want to see our image on the object, go to the viewport in the upper right hand corner. So we got viewport shading. So you can select that and it'll go to preview mode from here. So I'm not very good at Blender and we're going to, I'm pretty sure there's a hotkey to automatically do that <laughs> that I just did in the video which is stand the object vertically but that'll do that'll do for this project now these project uh, these objects they have to be quite small for smile game builder this would be a giant tree if we did it at its original size so we're going to scale that down and it's going to be quite tiny Zoom in, we need it even smaller. So right about there. So if we zoom out, you see our grid, you see how tiny that is, but that's just about the size we need it. And now we're going to slide the tree up the axis. So it's on top of our plane here. And personally, I don't like to have it exactly on top. I want it to cut just underneath so I know that when I import it, you know, it's kind of, it feels like it's attached to the ground in the game. But that's just about it. We have that nice and lined up. That looks great. And we're going to export it. Now for a Smile Game Builder, you need to export as an FBX file. So let's do that. So on your desktop, you might want to create a new folder for this. So the folder I created was called Test Model. So let's open that up. And we're going to name our file, our 3D model, after the texture, which is tree tune or whatever you use. And we're going to export. Now we can head over to Smile Game Builder. I'm going to add asset. Now it's an object, which will be found under maps. And if you look at the right hand tab, going to go to objects and then we'll go to add select your folder which is test model or whatever you named it and then we find whatever you named your object mine is tree tune so let's open that and we got an error now this is intentional this error is going to tell you that you need to have your object and its associated texture in the same folder with the same name so here we go. We need to put the texture tree tune.png into the folder. So we hit OK. Let's cancel out. Minimize those. So here we go. On our desktop, we have tree tune.png. Let's put that into our test model folder. Now we when we look into the test model folder, we have our tree tune. FBX and TreeTune PNG. Everything's lining up, has the exact same name. So let's try to import that into Smile Game Builder again. So we go to Add Assets. Once again, it's a map. And then we look on the right hand side for objects. Go to Add. And we're going to select our TreeTune once again. This time it's added. So now it's an object. Let's take a look at our TreeTune, our cartoon tree here. There we go. And let's see what it looks like in game. All right, let's go to objects here in the right, right hand and select our folder. And there it is, you see it spinning in the lower right hand side. So let's, let's put it in and there it is. We have our 3D object. Not a bad looking, but very flat tree. 
I mean, that's about it. Uh, thank you very much for watching this video, and I hope uh, you know it solves your issue for importing a 3D object into Smile Game Builder. Thanks.